Safer neighborhoods, good jobs, better schools. Those are some of the goals Tennessee's new governor says he's going to pursue. New tonight, six on your sides. Blake Stevens was in Nashville today as Bill Lee officially took over the state's top job. History happening today just over my shoulder as Bill Lee became Tennessee's 50th governor. Four former Tennessee governors sat on stage watching. Of course, when this all ended, there were five former governors on stage. The longest serving lawmaker in Nashville, Lieutenant Governor Randy McNally, kicking off today's ceremony. Are you ready to take the oath of office? I enjoyed the governors I've served with over the years, and, and all of them are, are different from each other. But I think basically all uh, had the best interests of Tennesseans at heart. The duties of the office of governor. McNally attending today's peaceful transition of power, a ceremony he sat in on dating back to the late 70s. So help me God. So help me God. Congratulations. Thank you. Thank you. Knox County Commission Chair Hugh Nystrom singing praises to outgoing Governor Haslam and spreading well wishes to his successor. Uh, ultimately, local governments work with state government to uh, make sure we're doing a good job taking care of folks in our community. And frankly, I really wanted to be here and be here with my family to, uh, to give my son and my wife and everybody just a chance to see this uh, important part of our state's history. So, Tennesseans, we stand in one of the great states in all of America, but our greatness has never come from what one individual has done. Our greatness has always come from the collective lives and service and commitment and sacrifice of those who have come before us. Congressman Chuck Fleischman taking a break from federal government shutdown talks to witness history with a message to Tennessee's new leader. I wish you the best and as your federal partner I'm going to continue to work very hard on the House Appropriations Committee to make sure that we get the federal dollars into our great state that we can get the job done. Tennessee's new governor offering a message of hope. I believe that we can do it. I believe that we can create safer neighborhoods good jobs, better schools all across our state. Former Governor Bill Haslam. So Bill, Godspeed my brother. Saying thank you. For the last eight years we have loved every bit of doing this and I can't thank you enough. Now former Governor Bill Haslam back in East Tennessee tonight. Haslam joking with the crowd that he would be driving back himself and driving for the first time since he was elected eight years ago. A big question remaining now that Senator Alexander announced he would not be running for re-election. What's next for the former governor? Of course, we'll keep an eye on that for you. In Nashville tonight, Blake Stevens, WATE 6 on your side. Yeah, and as you saw, leaders moved today's inauguration indoors to the War Memorial Auditorium. Normally, those ceremonies are outside in front of the state capitol, but today's rainy weather in Nashville caused a change of plans.